she was a fast machine. She did keep her motor clean. Just gonna let you fucking know right now, sporty, sport bock, whatever the fuck this place is called. The fucking spring bro, spring bro. What's happening right now with this name? Spring, spring, fuck you guys. I've done a lot of drugs. Spring bock, is that what we're going, is that what's happening? Is it someone, it's a deer? Thank you. Do we eat it here? Is that why we named it? Ha ha ha. The carnivores laugh. Thank you, sir. <laughs> you will only know when you've had the taste of venison in your mouth, young lady. Young lady. Look at me referring to myself as young. I don't use the talks. I don't. I have the real face. How are you? I'm a real face, bitch. Hello. I got a real face. I got no meds. I smoke a lot of weed, you know, it's, I try, I try to keep calm. Fuck people though, right? I mean, it's been a horrible week for us. Ladies, I mean, I mean a couple hundred years, but this week, really bad, right? God damn it. Uh, yeah, I won't go on, that's enough. I, uh, I'm from Hollywood, hello, thank you. I have the tattoo that says Los Angeles. You wouldn't fucking believe how many people ask me, so, you're from Los Angeles? No, Wisconsin, fuck you, what, no, what? Bastards. Yeah, I'm from LA. I'm from Hollywood. Hollywood. Come on, the glitz, the glamour. Are you kidding me? I love being from Hollywood. I do. I love watching people come to Hollywood and they walk around and they go, oh my god, a movie was shot here. Because I go to Hollywood and I walk around and I go, oh my god, I was shot here. <laughs> True story, thank you very much. True story. I was raised by wolves. I'll let you know about the shooting later in the set. But I, you know, when you're raised by wolves, they don't watch you, right? They don't watch you. It wasn't Hollywood that I was first in. I was first in Topanga Canyon. And if you've seen any movies about naked people, you maybe have seen Topanga Canyon mentioned. Very naked all the time, like all the time naked. Really, not a nudist colony, not a commune, not that structure. Do you know what I'm saying? Just naked, just, just high and naked. Just, pretty sure I breastfed off five different ladies. Do you know what I mean? Just here, it's free and it's love. Just take it. <laughs> Who made this baby? <laughs> it's awesome. <laughs> Scary though, right? In a like little girl, just a sea of naked adults. I'm fucking wandering around. I'm looking for my dad. Another true story. It's more of an after school special. <laughs> no, I mean, <laughs> yeah, they smoked a lot of weed at my, ow, that was hurting. Um, they smoked a lot of weed at my house uh, when I was little, a lot of weed. Uh, found out what my first word was just recently. I was excited, I was like, oh my God, my first word, was it mama, was it dada? No, my first word was ear. <laughs> it's exciting, it's exciting, right? You're like, oh yeah, this is fun. Thank you, I love you too. Vesty. Um, he's got a vest, he's cute. Uh, I like, I like an outlaw, I like an outlaw, sorry. I, I like an outlaw. My, my head is, is bulging. All right, I like, I, we'll cover it up, cover it up with the bangs. She fucking, she does it for her craft. It's for you people, do you understand? I'll beat myself silly just to make a laugh. That's what I do, that's what we do. It's a sad life as a comedian, it really is. Uh, anyway, don't feel bad, I went to therapy. Um, I, yes, so the, you know, Vesti, thank you. Uh, I always have Vesti, guys, so I don't worry about you guys anymore. I don't care about you anymore. We have a thing. Um, <laughs> I do love outlaws, though. I have a tattoo that says, uh, ladies love outlaws on my hip. Uh, it's misfilled. Yeah, it's misfilled. I don't know if you heard me. Yeah, all right, I didn't cover it up. Thanks. Um, I didn't cover it up, because I like illiterate outlaws, that's why. Because I'm like, fuck, check that out, motherfucker. You can't read it. Can you? You can't tell where the mistake is, right? I love you. I a lot of love for my outlaws. Uh, speaking of outlaws, when I was in seventh grade, because like, how do you rebel from hippie parents, you know what I mean? How do you rebel from the naked stoners, right? Uh, you know, they started shaving, I was like, fuck you guys. <laughs> Fucking hippies. <laughs> and, uh, and then I went to seventh grade, and at seventh grade, this Mexican dude came up to me with the hairnet and the flannel button at the top, you know the movies, right? And, uh, and he comes right up to me, he's like, Jessica, we've fucking been watching you, so you're crazy, homegirl. Listen up, this is Froggy talking to you right now. Oh my god, I was like, oh my god, Froggy. <laughs> Does that tattoo too? I mean, you killed somebody, because that's adorable. <laughs> and he goes, yeah, but that was a long time ago. Okay, we're in seventh grade. 
Very real, very real. I smoked a lot of PCP with Froggy and the gang. I did, like a lot of PCP. Like so much PCP that I'm really happy to be here tonight. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Another true story. Uh, boy, the night is full of truth, huh? It's feeling good tonight, feeling good. Yeah, we smoked a lot of PCP. And I was bad at it, guys. I'll be honest, we're family now. I was bad at the PCP, y'all. I was. I was bad. I was blacked out all the time, just passed out, you know? And Froggy would mess with me all the time. He's like, Jessica, you're, you're blacking out all the time, homegirl. You're fucking lightweight. I saw. I'm like, it's elephant tranquilizer, Froggy. I don't know if you've done the research. But all right. Let's turn the white people onto it. Here we go. Uh, yeah. So the night that I was shot, I wasn't with Froggy. I was some, some other gangers. And uh, we were over on Sunset Boulevard. And I was walking. And I know they didn't want me in the driveway because I was wearing a velvet skirt. So, you know, what gang is that, really? Right? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know who that is. Uh, but I was shot. Pow. And, um, and I didn't really know because, you know, PCP. And, uh, and then all of a sudden we were walking. And I was like, hey. Anybody else feel cold? You know, that was like my first thing. And then I looked down, I was like, oh my god, I'm bleeding. And I, uh, the weird thing about gang members is they not only will they not take you to the hospital if you get shot, but they will berate you and make fun of you if you'd like to go to the hospital, you know? So I was like, you guys, maybe we should go to the hospital. And then uh, my dude, the fucking Smiley, walked in and he's like, hey, Jessica. My cousin got shot in the head last week, home girl. We didn't go to the hospital. Like, oh my god, I'm so sorry. It's cool. All right, now I got a limp. What? What? Hey, hey, hey. God damn, still got that bullet in there. You guys won't feel it after the show. I'm like a carnival act. Come on over. All right. Um, yes, thank you so much. What else can I talk to you about? Um, uh, yeah, I was on Deaf Comedy Jam. This is an exciting, uh, Notion, and now I'm here. I know, huh? Big time for Jess Wood. I'll tell you. You can't. I know. You go Def Jam, then you go Spain Bach, fucking career. Pow! That's so what's happening. That's how. You, that's how it goes. Uh, I like it here. It's very nice. Thank you. Reverse, but thank you. I'll say. Um, Bessie, he's he's on my side. He's on my side. Uh, I was on Def Comedy Jam. So Cedric the Entertainer was my host. And if you don't know what Def Jam is, it's an all black comedy show. Um, and then I showed up and. Uh, Cedric the Entertainer was my host, a really sweet guy, but he had to bring me out to a crowd of almost a thousand people, not unlike tonight. <laughs> Thanks. And, uh, and he comes out and he's like, all right, y'all. <laughs> y'all enjoying the show so far? All right, yes you are, no, yes you are. For your next performer, I want y'all just to keep an open mind. <laughs> It. I'm going to leave you with that. My name is Jess Wood. Thank you so much, you guys. Let's give another hand for Jess Wood. That was awesome. Dude, right? This girl is crazy. I'm taking you out with me when I'm like on gang territory or something. You're like, all right, I'm bringing Jess. She's been shot and she's from LA.